Hi, this is me, and I'm playing Timber 3 on the PC. This is the uh, follow one from the coastal bit. This is the village. I'm going to put the um, diamond things through the in the snake's the mouth. There's a lot of these guys that jump out. This level, I didn't like this level when I played it. Years ago, I didn't have any shit, nothing at all. I should really pick them up because I've got all the guns and all of the things with that and I don't want I don't want to do the um cheat thing more than once in the entire game. So I did it once and then that's it and I'm not doing it again. So it'd be a bit too easy otherwise. It's not easy because I've got to get through the levels. So you have to get down, there's nothing else up here as I can see. Well, later on, a couple of guys turn up again and they kind of snipe at you. There's nothing up there, it's like. like canopy or something. So. Right, so what I want to do on here. is not get killed. And then go over and check it. Well, one of these huts has got a swamp in it, or quicksand. Nothing in them but a couple of health packs and this that and the other, so there's two halves and the first half this is obviously part one and the other one. They really have tough egg about hundred bullets. There's one with fire in it, the other one. What's that there? I could pick him up there. And you have to um, open a gate or something. That's the one with the. I'm not gonna go in there. You have to open. There's a bit that blocks your way. Where is it? There it is. You can't get through there. So there's all spikes and whatnot. So you have to go and find a pulley thing. I have to go for a bit of, a, bit of a walk because I can't think. And there's a trapdoor in that pool of water there. So, so if I can just remember what I've got to do, where things are, yeah, where are things? Hmm, oh there's something over there. Am oh, I missing something? Well, oh, that's what came in. <laughs> okay, I might miss this one. Um, I'm put like in these small bits and pieces there. There's another bit, I can't find a little passage. Where's the little passage gone? Oh, I've got one up. Oh, it's up. So you don't mean to kill them, but the problem is they're programmed to kill you, and if you don't kill them, they'll kill you. It's very annoying. Right, you've got to get up there, but that's towards the end of the level. I haven't been stuck on this for ages before. I'm not a clue what I had to do on it. That's the bit you got across in the next part. Is that kind of Okay. I'm going to say this because I'm probably going to end up falling in that. Okay, yeah, you have to do that to open the thing. Okay. It doesn't show you what it opens. Oh, it does. <laughs> there was another bit that it doesn't show you what it opens. Oh, yeah, you have to go like backwards, don't you? One minute. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? And then another guy comes up and he says, Shack there. Right, so that gets me access to the second half of the village. I was right, I was going to really struggle on this one because of the. It's not so much having all the guns and stuff, it's actually being able to persevere because of the problem with. Not 
don't know what to do. It's like that dead end thing where you don't know what you want to do, how, how it how to progress. And the, the um, sometimes the guides aren't very helpful. To be honest, you go, oh, what does that mean? And I don't I can't visualise that. And, and what's that? A door. Where is this? Oh, see, I've lost that. Where's the thing up there? Ah, very annoying. Oh, what the neck. No, I think I'm definitely on the wrong way. Oh, I have there. So that's where you have to cross. That's what the pulley opened. Oh, changed. This is the second half of the village. Now. I'm just checking to see if it's that swamp thing. There's a there's one of these with a thing in it, like a where is it? 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 Um, like a little stone thing. There it is. And you pull it and it opens the thing. And there's a guy in the little bit. Yeah, of course he does. Catch me out. I think I've done that right. I think there's more to this level. I, I just have this memory of it being incredibly difficult. It, was, it seemed like there was a million things you had to find out and I couldn't possibly work out what it was. And that's not... Is that open? Why does that not open? What have I done? Oh, there it is. Walking properly. Save that. We'll just save that one there. Okay. There's a ledge there, so I have to get. She's not sidestepping properly, this is because I'm near them. Oh! Okay, we'll save it, and we'll just come back. Okay. I think I did it before. I'll have to do it from there then. Oh. Now this bit is a miserable, difficult bit. There's a wooden thing above it or near it. So you have to go... Uh, on, on top of here. It's not altogether clear. Without the help of a guide, you just wouldn't really know why there was a thing on the roof. And I even, even I didn't even spot this thing until I was down on the ground. That there's a... No, no, no. Careful, careful. One of those ladder things. I didn't see that when I was stood there before. So you can't get over to this other, this other hut thing. Uh... So that's quite, that wasn't obvious unless you really looked at it. Not from the, from the ground, I couldn't see anything like this. Where does it go? Where does it go? And it stops. I fall onto there. Okay, now. I want it to fall there. This is like a secret thing. And you press this button. It's silly because that looks like it's made out of wood, and they've got like a gas cooker thing going on there. So I have to get back over there again. And there's a bit of a nasty trick on this one, though I've not practiced it more than once, twice maybe, before I did the video, so that's a bit of a tough mother. 
to get them right. But there's another thing that would trick the core design play on you. Involving that corridor bit there. Which I actually wondered, did I actually got to the point where I pretty much solved the level, I'll just say that, I'll just keep doing that again. And I'd actually worked the... <sighs> it's a very nice ladder, but we really want to get to this next bit. Yeah, you could have joined the circus, but you didn't. Right. Oh. oh, this is a bit of a toughie as well. This one, you're going to watch this one. I'm going to have to say that because I know I'm going to get burnt. I do apologise, I have to keep saying, but um... This is a standing jump, but I, I tried a standing jump. Oh! You get me to burn the wood. That's just very illogical. This is where we want to be. And here comes a jump. I'm getting it. With the life. <laughs> this bit here, I thought, oh, what do you have to do on that bit? You press it, it turns the gas on and it burns you. That's, that's the only reason, it turns on the burners, not doing anything else. Hooray, it's a spinny bladey thing. I don't know what to do with it Yay. Oh, it's very, very tight. This opens the trap, and I didn't know this did this until I looked at the um, walkthrough. So I was like, oh, what do I have to do? What do I do? And I was like, oh, I'm going to cave up and I then I went on the website and it's actually, oh, yeah, I did, I'd pretty much done it. Apparently the crocodile around here somewhere, so. Apparently. Oh, there's a crocodile. I don't like it. Don't like it, don't like it. Oh, I don't like it, come on. That's it, oh. I haven't seen this bit in about five years, so I'm... Not sure exactly what I'm gonna do now, just... I think it goes to the hut with a man in it. Ah, oh, here's, here's the bridge. Unless I'm wrong, I don't know. What's that? That's weird. Uh, I don't know what... This, <laughs> where this goes. Okay, there it is, okay. I'm gonna have to really jump for that. Oh no! Okay. It can't! Right, okay. Phew. That was weird. Not interrupting, am I? Not bleeding, are you? Not about to use this place as a dunny? No, and <laughs> no. Good. Good. Just don't want any fly-carrying visitors in here. Right. I understand. What happened? Woke up in the jungle with one of those little blokes snacking on my leg, didn't I? A tribesman? It isn't usual for them to eat right off the bone like that. Well, it was dark and I, I never got the bugger, so I can't be sure. Something spooky is in that jungle. Our air carrier crashed up in the mountains. Every night some of my men would vanish without trace. Others fled in fear. Then this happened. So I brought the men down to shore for safety. Only for us all to be captured by this greedy mob. Some sort of sacrifice to their god who lives up in the hills. Though it seems I've not been invited to the barbie. Maybe you're the dessert. Ripe flesh can be a bit of a delicacy around here. For real? Listen, we'd better get you out of here. Do you know how the tribe crossed the swamp down there? Which stones they tread on? Yeah, but, uh... Stay and put. With this wound, I'd be like a fill-up station to every diseased bug in the bush. I'd rather be the main course of the real feast. Hey, if you see any of my men alive in there, direct them to the North Shore, will you? Away from here. Of course. Okay, that's, uh... To which I couldn't hear any of that, and I put the volume up on my other computer. It'll give me feedback and all kinds of... I think uh, the guy gave a map for the swamp part for the next bit so that's going to be my next video so i'll see you then <laughs>